Greetings everyone, the Good Sir Knight here, and it has been a while, but today we're going to be discussing something very important. We're going to be discussing the Glock 18C, which I've done a review on. Semi full auto modes. But not just the Glock 18C, but the Glock 18C in comparison to a Safari Land Glock 17 holster. Now this is a Glock 17 holster, and the big problem that people have, which is why at least to some fraction of an extent, when people choose the Glock 17 over the 18, despite the 18 being a 17 with full auto, it's, well, the holster compatibility. Like, for example, if the Glock 18C is really just a 17 with full auto, then a Glock 17 holster should be no problem for a Glock 18, right? Huh. We seem to be snagged. So the problem here is that the holster doesn't go all the way in. You can see we're clearly snagging on something. And as to where, it looks like it's somewhere on the sides. The Glock 18 upper frame seems to be a bit thicker than the Glock 17. Now, I don't have a Glock 17 per se, but we do have a Glock 26 with a little Splatoon charm. The Glock 26 is basically like a smaller 17 anyway, so to keep that in mind, You'll see it fits the 70 holster just fine. Draw, fit, no problems. So Glock 17 will fit in the Glock 17 holster, but not the Glock 18. So I do really enjoy Safari Land, and I'm sure to some special custom order, they can do a Glock 18C holster officially. However, given all that into account, there is a solution that I found almost entirely through accident which is through the application of light. Now this is just a cheapo Tokyo Maruri that I've shaved the uh, clip part off of to get it to fit better, but this will work. Attach this onto here, like so. The Glock 18 has a little light. Well, good sir night, how is this relevant? Well, because they also make a Safari Land Glock 17 holster that has a light attachment. You know, there's a little slot for a light. Now it's not perfect, the Glock 18 is for whatever reason a bit wider or whatever, so it does sit a bit lower, which is why I had to shave that bottom part off. But you take this holster, however, also designed for Glock 17, same company, and oh look, it fits fantastic. Let me take it over here, put it on our leg rig, boom, problem solved. Now we have a Glock 18C. Full auto with a magic little torch light on the front. Now you might be thinking, well, where's the awkward part? Well, the awkward part is that it sits higher, which is probably due to the center of balance. So this is the original two pegs that you'd normally use, and there'd be a center one down here, but there isn't. There's two more pegs down here and then one down here. So it's a bit longer. You've got your adjustment screw here to, depending on the light, so you can make it tighter or looser which is kind of important when you're using different types of lights. However, you can't make it longer, hence why I needed to trim down the light. But it fits, and it can quick draw, which is really everything you need a Glock 18C to do anyway, and it's a backup weapon. So, assuming the main weapon goes down or needs to do something else, mags, Glock 18. Actually, how fast can we draw it? You can get it out, you can get it out and ready pretty quick, so. I'd argue it's probably a fraction of a second slower due to the addition of a light. You also need to take a bit more extra care to make sure you're putting the light back in. But it does fit in. It fits properly. It sits a little high. But that's not really a problem. And no other issues with the gear. So if you get a Glock 18C and you want to use a Safari Land holster, just be prepared to get the one that has all the light to it because the standard Glock 7 holster isn't going to fit. So. Now, basically what we've done is we've established empirical evidence that the Glock 18C is not, in fact, a 17 with full auto. It is, but it isn't. Because if it truly was, then the holster would also work, but... Okay, maybe there's a Glock 18C holster made by Safari Land that I just don't know about. Maybe. But, in the meantime, I was able to pick this up for like... 22 $23 on eBay, so... There you go. A holster. For Glock 18C with an active locking system and an additional little light. Smooth. 
So, that's basically all I had for you guys. I just kind of wanted to talk about those topics real quick. And yeah, so, if you get a... I, know, I guess you could just stick with a Glock 17. Full auto is just going to be spraying extra rounds everywhere. Fun, but not technically the most effective. But hey, Airsoft, if you're not having fun, then hey, what's the point, right? Alright, cheers everyone. See you in the next video.